Hello everyone, this is Sarah. Today I'm gonna show you how to insert our 12 kilowatt water cooking radiator. Okay, let's open the case. Here are all the accessories of water cooking radiator. This is the radiator. Water pump, 3 meter water pipe, 2 connector, bottle, power cable, some screw, the bottle branky, the branky of power supply, the branky of water pump. Now let's go to insert them. Firstly, we use the screwdriver to insert the branky of power supplier and the water pump. Now we connect the water pump and the power supplier to the radiator. And the power the water pump. Now we cut a 16 cm water pipe to connect the outlet pole of radiator to the water pump. Now we are going to the test room and our engineer will show us how it works with the first miner. In addition to these accessories, we also need to buy two hose clamps and two original joints to go with M33S++. The blue one is for cold water, the red one is for hot water. Now our engineer using the water pipe to connect the radiator to the water miner. Using the pipe to connect the port near the pump to the blue original joint and tie it with a screwdriver. And the bottom one is connects the outer layer of the water miner. According to the same color, we connect the joint in miner. Our engineer just finished the assembly part of the miner and the radiator and now using the bottle to floor the pump with two M. Please note, don't add water, only distill water and the two M. Power in with our original power cable and let the air out of the radiator. We need to monitor if the water level drops. If the water level drops, continue adding coolant until the level does not drop. Need to add about 4 to 5 times. Connect the network cable and the power cable of the miner and let it work. Now we have been running in regular mode. The original country is still under the third The power consumption per is 31. The power consumption is 7,700 volts. The available temperature of the 100 volt is 55. The available temperature of the chip is 65. The available temperature of the environment is 40. The temperature of the fluid is 42. Now we are telling you how to overclock the hot miner. First, we need to select the miner and then turn on the remote control. Select switch performance mode. And the choose time. And then click OK. After 30 minutes, the miner will be running in high performance mode. We are running in high performance mode. Let's look at the test day. The hot rate is 280 p. The power consumption per HP is 34. The power consumption is 9600 volt. The eventual temperature of the heart rate board is 60. The eventual temperature of the tube is 19. The eventual temperature of the metal is 43. The temperature of the fluid is 46. The above is of the total of the water volume. 